Hi, welcome to the video. Today we're going to be doing some very light restoration work on this Marc Jacobs handbag. So I'll run you through what we're going to be using. Uh, this is the dye cream that we're going to be using. And it's, as you can see, it's the same color as the bag. We've actually got 40 shades of these, so they're fantastic to match to your bag. We've also got the My Bag Nourishing Cream. So all you do with this is just apply it with the brush and uh, you can clean any waxes or oils or just general dirt from your bag and then the little brush and the cloth. Oh. So as you can see, the corner of the bag is a little worn out and just in need of some TLC. So before we use the dye cream, first of all, we just need to clean it. And we're going to be using the My Bag Universal Cleaner. So this is a really nice, simple product. And all you want to do is just put a little bit of it on a cloth and then just rub the bag. And now once you're sure this area of the bag is clean, you just want to leave it for 10 to 15 minutes just for it to dry before you start using the dye creams. So now that we're happy that the corner of the bag is dry, we're actually gonna go on to recoloring it and dyeing it with the My Bag Color Cream. So you just want to use a very, very small amount of this. We'll just get it on the brush. like this. And then we're just going to paint it in. And then we just want to dab it in. You're not trying to cover it all with the first coat, you're just trying to get a nice base coat. Okay, so that's the first coat done. We're going to let this dry for 10 to 15 minutes before we put on the second coat. So it's now 15 minutes later and I've just had a look at the corner of the bag again and it's looking absolutely fantastic. It's now dry, so let's put a second coat on. So you want to load the brush up with paint, but you wanna make it as thin as possible. So if you look at the side view, you can see that I've just been doing this against the pot and it just makes it nice and sharp so that when you're actually getting into the delicate corners, it's much easier. And then sometimes what I like to do is actually just dab the brush, just so you get the same consistency as you do with the leather. You've definitely got to wait until the dye is completely dry before applying the second coat because you'll take the first coat off. So this has just been a short video just to show you how to restore your bag using my bag products. I'll post a link in the description to where you can purchase them. Please remember to like, subscribe and share our videos. Thanks for watching.